measurement of frequency and guide wavelength so first beam voltage should be set to 270 volts then we need to go to referral voltage we need to change the referral voltage till we get some amount of current before setting the referral voltage we should always be at the right most right since we got some current we need to note down that value then we need to start changing this until we get minimum most probably it comes as zero So we need to note down this value here. It's approximately 10 centimeters. Then we need to again rotate it till we get one more zero. So this value is around 12 centimeters. Now we need to move it to some random position where we are getting some good current. Then we need to change this frequency until we get a certain depth. So let us try in the other direction. So we get a sudden dip. We need to note down the value between both the copper wire. It would be around 9.35. So that should be our measured value. And D1, D2 will always be between 10 and 12. Like just around 10 and 12 all the values of D1 and D2. Once we get D1 and D2 we need to find lambda G and lambda C and lambda naught. From lambda naught we can find calculated F. These words should these both values should be matched.